You're gonna make me pick? Date with destiny. Cookies Cavern. Up or down, Jet? Stego says up. Trust me. Down, down, down. Down? All right, let's go down. <laughs> This level is in honor of Dram 2's Cetacean Cavern. I like the aesthetic background. No secret. Oh. Ah, yes. The vanilla experience. You should rename this hack to the vanilla experience. Stego. I've never finished Ram 2, no. Thought so. I knew I'd find one. You don't make a level, you know, fucking inspired by Pangea Panga. Oh, great. Classic vanilla. <laughs> he is truly never living down. He is truly never living down. I wanted a vanilla experience. Cracks me up. Steganilla. Vanilla Stegosaurus. <laughs> Steganilla sounds like a disease. It is, and you fucking have it. You know you do, motherfucker. <laughs> uh, Mr. Crispies. Where's your alert, dude? There it is.
Uh, Mr. Krispies, thanks for 11 months. I really appreciate that. Wow. Any me in chat? Thank you for continuing the sub from Joker. Holy shit. Uh, I really appreciate that, Lars. Yeah, 1% of people continue their subs. That's crazy. Thank you. I would sit here and create a goal for reaching 700 uh subscribers but i think we should wait on the goal making until after i beat responsible world Yeah, non-gift, non-prime. We're at like 675. I checked this morning. But, um... Yeah. I don't want to like sit here and make a goal when I've already got a really big one that I set for myself. Too fucking good for you. Thank you for the 16 months, dude. If I turn back that first dolphin, I think I could just run across. For it? No. I mean, yes. I mean, no. No, don't actually floor it. Totoro with five gift subs. Thank you so much, Totoro. Holy shit, dude. Wrote a huge essay in film school, uh, film school about my neighbor Totoro. Wow. Holy shit, Totoro with seven more gift subs. Jeez. Thank you, Totoro. Holy shit. For gifting a total of 200 subs to the channel. Uh, 
Ah, uh, bucket. Holy shit. Holy shit. Bucket face with 12 months of the tier three and St. Patrick star. Thank you for the five months. God damn you guys. I don't get it. How's it going? Um. Holy shit. That makes all the difference. All the difference. 69 cats continuing their sub they got from infamous Greg. Holy shit, dude. Yo, thank you. Yeah, I gotta go faster. The one percent. Yeah, this is a very vanilla hack. I mean, I'm really enjoying it. Yeah. I actually am enjoying the game. Looks like a cool hack. It's actually really good. Spikes have always killed Mario. Now I actually prefer the spikes to munchers. I don't know how everyone else feels. I fucking hate muncher spam. Spikes where it fits. Doritos have misleading hitboxes. Don't munchers also? doesn't I mean, I get he wants me to go fast there. I just it doesn't feel like I'm supposed to go fast. See? Don't tell him that third wall. He'll ner he'll fucking buff it.
fair? I'll show you fair! That's, that's Stegosaurus. Maybe I'm supposed to lure the, the dolphin over and then ride it back. Yeah, third wall. He decided not to put in the frame rule patch because he wanted a vanilla experience. Those are his words, not mine. His words. Yeah. I mean, he's definitely deserved it. He, he's definitely earned the roast. Yeah, your LR scrolls. Frame rules can be totally uh, designed around. Even with uh, like 12 shell bumps in one level. Yeah, I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Isn't it third wall? Notice it's awful, not like rejected. <laughs> I gotta bounce up through it so that way I don't catch it. So did you guys watch the SpaceX launch yesterday? Yo, that shit looked like it was sci-fi. What they do this time? The rocket went into the air, did a flip, and landed. It landed, and then it exploded, but it landed. It landed before it exploded.
I would say when it comes to SpaceX, there's no true failures. Everything that SpaceX is doing is like solidifying our venture into space. Yeah, exactly. It's all just a stepping stone. Absolutely. Do a cake flip. Their landing record is about as good as Launchpad and DuckTales. <laughs> I forgot about Launchpad McQuack. Yeah, exactly, Nightburn. 100% agree. I think Prism was just making a joke. I think I think Prism Ranger just wanted to make a joke about Launchpad. The new DuckTales is so good. Yeah, happy little accident. Absolutely. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Oh. Yeah, we're talking about SpaceX. How horrible they've become recently, Ronnie. Get your shit out of here. Get your fucking shit out of here. They put a rocket in the fucking sky, did a flip, and it landed, and then exploded. That's a fucking plus. That is a huge plus. If you don't like SpaceX just because Elon Musk, just don't like Elon Musk. But if you're saying what he's do what if you're saying what Elon Musk is doing is bad for humanity, like you're just being intellectually disingenuous. You could totally not like the guy. not come back you don't like him see and that's fine you don't have to like him you don't have to like him I totally get why people don't like Elon Musk I like the guy. I think he's, I, I, I like the guy. All right. I like the guy. You don't have to like him. Yeah, I was gonna say like, look at the fucking, the, like, look at Mark Zuckerberg. Look at the people who are in charge of Apple. Look at the people designing cars. I mean, like there's hundreds of people you could pick from to dislike. I think it's just, it's easy to hate on Elon Musk because he is such a center point in the limelight.
He gets way too much credit. I would agree. I would definitely agree. You like him so much, why don't you marry him? I don't like him that much. $20 is $20. How fucking marry him? That dude is loaded. He's a bit of a douche. That's fine. I'm a bit of a fucking douche. I think if the worst thing you could say about him, he's, he's a bit of a fucking asshole. I mean, yeah, so is most of the fucking population. Oh, you know? He fired someone and he didn't do it professionally. He fired someone and he yelled at them in front of everyone. Can you believe this guy? We're about to see if I can catch that dolphin. He couldn't afford directors. You're a bit of a douche. We already know that, Robert Mondavi. I think we can all be a little bit of bitches and assholes time to time, you know? I don't think that makes people bad people. Oh, uh, what's up, summon the poop? I'm gonna be a douche and say Tofu told me to. Okay, that's fine. Jared Leto is good people. Okay, so the dolphin just doesn't come back. Got it. You told me that I was on thin fucking ice the other day and it had you laughing your ass off. I mean, you are on thin ice. You are on thin ice. If you say something that irks me the wrong way, I'm banning you for good this time. I don't like habitual line steppers like you. Who are incapable of reading a room. You know? I'm not a fan of those kinds of people. 
Don't I know about the vanilla interaction? Oh, you mean the dolphin coming back? Yeah, yeah, no, I love that kind of interaction. It, it, it truly feeds to the vanilla experience. There's three kinds of people. Dicks, pussies, and assholes. Oh. Yeah. You know what I've learned about maturity? Maturity is just knowing when to be immature. That's it. I would say I have a pretty mature audience. Because they know when to be immature. learn about maturity oh. <laughs> <laughs> week uh, I've got a very open asshole after uh, playing this game it's gonna it's gonna take a week or two for that to close up again My asshole needs time to heal again. Freshness is essential. That makes all the difference. All the difference. You may, you know, man makes fart noise and I subscribe. Oh my god, Sour Dude, thanks for the 16 months. Let's try again. Will I get more subs if I hand fart? Hello, Polly Guitar. Do the armpit squeeze? I can't do that. <laughs> nice squeaker to finish it off, eight out of 10. <laughs> Smoke Log was impressed. Smoke gifting a sub to Jurgen. Thank you. Johnny Pacifist gifting a sub to uh, Kino Der Killer Karpfen. Sure, whatever that name is. Golden boy with five months. Yes. Going on, golden boy. You like farts depending on the situation. Like cakes, Ronnie? Ne next thing Ronnie's gonna say. <laughs> Next thing Ronnie's gonna say is like, you know, I also like cakes. Depending on the situation, I love a good fart. Especially when they involve cakes. Hey Ronnie, thank you for the gifts up to Blood Raid. 
Depending on the right situation, I like a good cake. <laughs> uh, stupid. <laughs> are we going down that path again? Yes. Yes, we are. <laughs> Fuck that, I want pie farts. For some reason, pie farts sound so much worse than cake farts. <sighs> Twinkle shits. Lovely. Way better than cake. Man, you know, you know what I miss? Like, being in Southern California, it's really easy to go to Disneyland. But you know, you know what I really miss? A good churro. Man, I want a good churro. I miss churros. Wow. Hey, what's up, LaForge? Jack in the box? Wow. Ah. Honestly, not sure what's worse, Jack in the Box or McDonald's. Costco sells churros, do they? LaForge, when you're older, you'll understand. Your butthole can take it. It's a sky dolphin. I'm going to fucking ban you, Stegosaurus. I'm going to fucking ban you. What's up, Nate Dog? Alright. Yeah, let's get some Pepe D. A Skullfin! No, we don't have cow jam, but I've got a clean now. We have a clean. We've got a really good clean. I uploaded it yesterday. Or added it. This is essential. I get it.
But yeah, that's that that's uh Ronnie after all the cake farting. Who said that you know you like to fart in certain situations, okay? Yeah. Yeah, you're you're the fucking one who said, you know, when the when the time is right, I love a good fart. Don't at me. I see what's gonna happen. You fart during intercourse, it's just a turbo kicking in. He called the sex intercourse. Someone's username, a loud shower fart. And it makes you laugh. We use the term making love. Uh, I feel like if you're gonna use the word fart, you have to use the word fornicate too, right? Farting during during fornication. Fornication. God, that's a fucking tongue twister. <laughs> Farting during fornication. Uh, Obsidian gifting a sub to Juicy Tooth. Thank you, Obsidian. Thank you, Obsidian. Flatulation. Sex means masturbation for most of us. That's not masturbating. Sex isn't masturbating. Would you like some making fuck? Good old days of the vanilla Mario experience. I guess this lava is turned off by the on-off switch. That's my only guess. Classic vanilla experience. Have you guys been watching that ROM hack that Link has been playing called SMW Gaiden? That game looks fucking crazy. That game looks like a modern day, I don't want to say hyper six, but I mean like, it looks, it looks rough for a non Kaizo hack. Now. 
the final bro boss sprite was great. Oh, I don't want to know about it. I'm probably going to end up playing it. Vanilla extract. CR. Wait, KRC. Wait, KCRW? What is that? What is KCRW? Listen to Spotify. You know, I've been listening to a lot of recently is um, Lincoln Park. Lincoln Park and Evanescence, actually. Yeah, there's some man meteora and hybrid theory jeez time favorite groups you guys see that uh matt hafey and mike shinoda were making a song together on twitch have you heard rubber ducky no no i haven't I didn't know Evanescence had new music. People are like, wait, who's Mike Shinoda and Matt Heafy? Oh, that was too fast. Thumbnail is hilarious to this channel right now. Spring just dropped a new album. What? Mike Shinoda is the singer in Lincoln Park. The one that's still alive anyway. Dude, new system of a down. Genocidal Humanoids, I think, is one of my favorite songs from them. Oh. 
Yeah, there's been two new system of a down songs. They released them to bring awareness to the Armenian war going on. And how their country was being invaded. Level is so easy. <laughs> you want to trigger Stegosaurus? Now you know. Yeah, look at how easy this part is, man. I'm already back here. Easy, dude. Reminds me of Quickie World 2. <laughs> I'm probably gonna die. My only secret. Yeah, the ending room. It's funny. Nah, I've been trying to fucking poke and prod Stegosaurus for all the shit he's made. This level is in honor of Dram 1's Dram Butthole. I'm spin jumping. I'm spin jumping. It's time. All the playtesters here saying it's time is worried. Oh, well, fucking pardon me, motherfucker. All right, all right. A Kaizo is fucking rude. We'll see what happens. Smash this level and tell him it was easy. He'll blow up. Alright. Uh, okay. Okay, 
I see. Und Spin Jump. <laughs> I made another one. Fuck you. So I see. It, it had nothing to do with he wanted me to. He wanted me to play this level last because it's, I guess, the hardest level in the game. I'm guessing. Give me a break. You don't think it's the hardest? What about your play testers? Tricky jump. I find that jump a lot harder than the Kaiser block avoidance here. This was used as a level for Darkenine's birthday. And he loved it. Okay. I think so far the only level that's been absolutely deplorable is the low gravity level. Low gravity sucks. Low gravity absolutely fucking blows. I don't want to land right on it. I want to land before the coin. Oh. Keep landing on it. It's like, it's like my eye sees the coin and it's drawn to it. Oh. Shiny. So I have to like, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, Mimi. He even says that this is a level dedicated to Dram's butthole or inspired by. just got PTSD. Where's Tater and Joe? Where's Tater Holly, Joe Vulgar, and Dvik? You can't wait to visit the butthole. the level was what everyone made it out to be. Yeah, but the ball and chain is like the entire level, you know? The entire level is built around that ball and chain. How much Dark Souls you're playing? I'm I'm surprised. I'm surprised you're even that far, Swift. You get 12 hours in a week. 
I get you. Okay. Wow. That is going to be really hard. Holy shit. You see that? You got to get two bounces off that. the long haul the shell is tricky I'll figure it out I feel like this block is the one thing that actually frame rule helps out. Because if I avoid the very tippy edge of the Kaizo block with frame rule. Perfect. Hey, what's up, Corey? I wonder. I'll have enough time. Hmm. Uh, red with rage. Thank you for the four months of prime, dude. How many of you guys have been keeping up with Simply and Cheese on the SM64 world record? Dude, Simply was on pace for a 37 until... Um, all right, I do have enough time. Interesting. Sorry, hold on. Uh, he got he got all the way to um, big and little. I forgot the love the level's name. Lar the the it's the Goomba portrait that you turn big and small. He was on pace for a thirty-seven up till that point, which is like huge, huge, tiny, huge. Thank you. Little, big, tiny, huge. I always forget. I think simply we'll take it back.
120 star. Yeah, all stars. Yeah, eight hours a day. He's on the grind, dude. Crazy. That dude's got some serious determination. <clears throat> you miss Liam? I never really watched Liam. Liam's in prison? What the fuck did he do? You respect anyone who can speedrun a game for months. Yep. Let alone years, dude. Look at Mitch. Look at ZFG. Look at fucking Majin Phil. Hey, what's up, Lunchbox? That shell's actually not as bad as it looks. He stole too many cliff bars. Oh, there's a meme saying that he's been floating around jail prison. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. I thought he actually was in jail or prison. After a few weeks, you're usually so done. Yeah, I feel like I've been in the same boat, dude. It really doesn't take much for me to kind of like, eh, I'm not interested. is Brad brains is I also feel like I, I, I feel like I have this discussion like at least once a week but I'm much more concerned on being a successful streamer than I am being a successful speedrunner and uh, you know being the best speedrunner doesn't mean you have the fucking that doesn't mean it grows your channel doesn't grow your channel the same way being a good streamer is, you know? Oh. Yeah, long grinds can be super hard. Really good speedrunners, but they're boring people. Well, holy shit! That makes all the difference. Uh, nobody you know. The 13 months and Giga Gignavolt. Gignavolt, thank you for the eight months. Um, well, like, look at the perspective, right? Like, <clears throat> this is what I always think of: is speedrunning has one curse right speedrunning's curse as is that usually the most competitive people with the most competitive times 
reset all the time. And that's usually the problem with viewership, right? Like, I mean, you, you could hear Andy talking about it on how like back in the day they used to make it so their splits were green because you'd get pace pals to come watch your channel. They're called pace pals or people who only come by when you're on a good pace. Like that's just universal across Twitch, right? Like it happens to fucking everyone. I mean, I'm a fucking pace pal. I only like watching Simply when he's, you know, like 30 minutes into a run. Um, but that's that's usually the problem with 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 speed running is at the end at the end of the day, like you're gonna be resetting a lot. Yeah, that Andy. Everybody wants. Yeah, exactly. People want to be there for the PB, but that's about it. Yeah. And like, I get it. I get it, dude. I'm the same fucking way. I'm the exact same fucking way. What's going on, Spud? I only came here for the hand farts. <laughs> All for you. Almost fucked up. Uh, Tanu Kaido, thank you for six months, dude. Almost a year? I mean, in relation to like a few seconds, yeah, it's definitely almost a year. You missed the low gravity part? Oh, that's fine. You didn't actually miss anything then because the level was shit. No, no, seriously, fuck low gravity. Uh, Spud, holy shit, dude, thank you for 20 months. And, uh, Jimmy T. Jimmy T, thank you for the gift sub to one spicy tuna roll. Yeah. Uh, what's up, yellow? He made a level for you and it was low gravity? Wow. So what you're saying is, is he absolutely fucking hates you then. Cause you don't make, you don't make a low gravity level for someone you like. If Stegosaurus ever made a level for me and it had low gravity, I would actually ban him. Like not even memeing, like you would actually be gone from this channel. I would never play it and get banned. And I would just move on with my life. Like, no memes. I would be actually upset.
And how does this remind you of Celeste? He does have a problem, but he wants to make sure I don't make people cry. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. How did the house hunting go? Um, what? We haven't gone looking at new properties for like a week. In core side, seek side core. Oh. <clears throat> no, I'm not house hunting. Not today. No, yesterday was rest and relax. Hold jump right there. Oh no, I I I I do believe, like, there really is no point in keep, keeping out the frame rule patch. Keeping out the frame rule patch is just, I feel a, like a rookie mistake. Like, it's cool to sit there and think of. Oh, progress. Mario only interacts with uh, a sprite every other frame. So what happens is sometimes you get halfway through the sprite and then interact with it, which causes you to have lower jumps. Sometimes you die. Um, yeah. Yeah, like every single sprite. Every single sprite Mario interacts with. Only interacts with every other frame. And the game runs at 60 frames per second. Oh. I think that's like my only criticism. <laughs> third wall, third wall things you could design around it. <clears throat> and you can, sure. But why would you? Why not just put it in? Unless you want your game to be inconsistent, but I think that's just like for taste. In my opinion. Oh. One and two is pretty big inconsistency. Oh. 
Yeah. Yeah. Happen on all SNES games? I don't know. I have no idea. I only play fucking Super Mario World. I, I, I don't have a knowledge base for the entirety of the SNES fucking collection. Why else would you sub? Because I have some of the best fucking emotes on this website. Oh. Fuck yeah, you do. What's up, King? Jessa Tav, thank you for gifting the sub to Lord Fura Fura. Take one on the house. Oh, thanks. Thank you for making me a freeloading cunt. <laughs> okay. What have you done? Well, anyone who gets gifted a sub here instantly becomes a freeloading cunt. Because you're having someone else pay for the benefits that you get. You're freeloading and you're a cunt. You were already a cunt, but now you're a freeloading cunt. Cunt or a cunt? You're a cunt. Of course. Go on, penguin. Ah. You have nine gifted subs active. Sure is. Sushi tacos or gourmet burgers? If the answer could ever be sushi, it should always be sushi. Oh. 
Does that make you a prime cunt? No, that makes you a princess. If you have prime, then you're a princess because you've got a little crown next to your name. Frame rule bullshit. <clears throat> Frame rule bullshit. If you have turbo, you don't get a free sub. So you're still a cunt. An invisible ink Kaizo block tattoo. Hey Tofu, would you ever get a tattoo of this one random thing about SFW? Would you do that, Tofu? Would you? Yeah, you know that. Can you? Stop right there, criminal scum. Nobody breaks no, the law on my watch. No, why would I? Invisible tattoos are fucking stupid in the first place. And if I ever got like a Mario tattoo, you think the first thing I'd resort to is a Kaizo block? I'm gonna get a Kaizo block tattooed on my asshole so that way it's an immediate giveaway to no entry. Don't get invisible ink tattoos, guys. They're fucking terrible. They cause issues. Just don't do it. This really blew up in your face. You never know with me. Sometimes, you know, you could say, like, I could blow up on you for any fucking reason. Great. I would love to know where to go. really man I really regret saying that don't take it personally brontosaurus bumpties on my nipples Garbellion with 15 months. Thank you so much, Garbellion. Is there something I'm missing? Oh, and the tier two. 15 months and the tier two. Thank you, Garbellion. K with two months. Uh, thank you so much, Milty. I'm going to assume it's not broke because Stegosaurus would probably be reacting differently. The two month. Hey, what's up, Rock? It's not broken. Oh. 
I have a theory. I hope my theory is not correct. No, it's not of a terrible band. Boom crash. Is correct. You gotta wait. I'm going too fast, which I think is maybe a little silly. You gotta wait longer. Either I'm doing something too fast or the level is intending for you to wait. See, there it is, the floor. Oh. Of maybe one other thing. I'm so excited for Sunday night now. With the new Among Us update. Hey, what's up, Dynadom? Or not update, I should say mod. If you guys don't know, there, it's not the new map, but there's a mod of new roles and we're going to be playing Sunday. Sunday night like we used to. You still need to play Among Us? Who she ordered? What roles are they? There's like 12 of them. 12. All of them. All of them interest me. We used to play Among Us every uh, Sunday, Irik. And then like the game kind of died down, so we stopped. But um, the new mod has me hyped as fuck. Yeah, we're playing with the community.
Town of Us. It's called Town of Us. I don't know the exact people, but they're people who are regulars here. I'm sure Grim will want to play. We'll have, um... Uh, Jazz said she wants to play. Space Vixen said she wants to play. My wife will play. Doing laps, doing laps. Killing someone for touching my lunch bowl. Want to have sex in the bathroom? Ew, no. <laughs> hey, what's up, Miss Calc? Yo, Miss Calc. Smithereens was fucking badass, dude. I loved Smithereens. watched my playthrough last night I saw your name and I was like oh that's the guy who made uh hanging out with Mr. Koopa I remember that he had some unique setups in that game super cool welcome back Hyrulean Watching you die countless times, Hyrulean. The Cemetery Blooms checkpoint. <sighs> Pure catharsis. Uh, it's a, yeah, if you look, Doge. Honor of Dram 1's Dram's butthole. That first death in the pipe felt so bad. Yep. Yep. You can always expect a ghost house to be a little tricksy. You're on Akogar right now doing QQ aids. It's wrecking you. Second one felt worse because it was your fault. That shit was gold. are rustling and bustling. Oh. 
It's so weird. Kaylin's at school right now. She's at work. And it's been so long since she's actually been out of the house, like away from me. It's like, it almost feels like weird that the house is empty, you know? Yeah, they're friends. Yeah, they've been playing at night. It's in the middle of the fucking night and you hear them running around the fucking living room. She's still super fucking scared of us though. She, she's still like, can't stand me and Caitlyn. Can't stand us. Yeah, the fishing boo is not a troll. The troll is the moving up fucking platform. That's also not a troll. That's a secret. Ah, it's a secret troll. Up. You having a blast? Good. Now here's the question. Do I need to hit the Kaizo block to get in there? gem as usual. Oh. Who's excited for Responsible World Grind starting next week? Oh. Next Friday. Oh man. Yeah, I mean, the attempts for single sitting. I have to relearn the game first. No, eight hours. That's going to be my limit. It's not going to be done on the first try either, of course. 
Every day we play, we're gonna start over from the beginning. And we will be taking breaks to play newer ROM hacks when I want to. But... Yeah. No, that's the hardest blind level. It's the hardest blind level, but it's not the hardest level over the entire game. Yeah. Yes. Yes, there will be safe state practice. You got it. Well, you'd be surprised, Nate Dog, if one day goes by that I don't play Responsible World. You know what people are gonna be like? Dovo, Dovo. I mean, I know, I know you were playing yesterday, and you're not today. But when are you gonna go back? Are you, are you, are you done? Are you done with Responsible World? Uh, it, it, people are gonna be fucking obnoxious as shit with it. People don't seem to listen that well, do they? No, they don't. <laughs> yeah, like Dyna Dot. Are you? Are you? Are you done with Crunchier? Cause like I, I, I saw you playing it the other day and I didn't see the ending and too bad. Oh. Okay. Yep. Exactly, ideal editor. Exactly. Cape is good. Cape is good. Don't let people tell you otherwise. Dawn of the third day. I actually already did. Like literally. got a full video made yeah yeah yep stop right there yep, yep, criminal yep. scum nobody breaks the law on my watch uh yes it is it was one of my most unused emotes so i went over to um bits
Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Exclamation point YouTube. Yeehaw. Yeah, you guys should all sub to my YouTube channel if you're not already. And go follow me on Twitter. I mean, Twitter, sorry. Freudian slip. You can, but I haven't done it. Why would I when people could pay money to get sub to it and then I get paid in return? Subbed it, shit like that wouldn't happen. Stones. Stones. <laughs> hey, what's up, Lizzie? I'm a freeloading cunt. No shit, I'm a Twitch streamer. Doesn't get much more freeloading than that. Sure, what the fuck I'm even doing here? Maybe I have to. I don't. I don't know. I mean, I've got to land, hit the switch, and go in between the skewers. Punching myself in the dick. I feel achieved. Oh, my balls feel so much better now. I am whelmed. <laughs> yeah, just punch yourself in the dick. Aggressively. What was the transition to playing hitbox like? That's a very personal question, Jimmy. It was fine. Is 
that what it is? Oh. Going on, Sponge. That's fine. I feel like people make a big deal out about switching controllers. Like, it's like... accident <laughs> Fuck. Oh. Jesus You know, if it wasn't for the saw blade, I would try really hard to cheese this. Do it. You can't. I know I can. That's why I'm not going to do it. I mean, okay, so I'm gonna have to sticky fly and then let go real quick, which is super easy on a hitbox. Okay. That's fair. Hamana ha. Hmm. What's going on, DJ? Oh. 
I like that dog emote. Whose is that? Thunderful? Cute dog. So, Stego, why did you have two diverging paths at the very end? Like, what was your purpose behind that? Oh. Nothing more. Oh, of course. Oh, oh, thank you. Thank you, of course. Oh. Huh. I thought it'd be more complicated than that. yourself literally fuck your own face damn yes papa chifo just like that You gotta go and then take off. I get it. Blobfish. Mentoring new people at a job is exhausting. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Going on, big dog. I think I could have made that. Yeah. Uh, no one at my current job uh, expected anything but learning from the fur for the first three months. I was fucked at my new job because no one took the time for like six months to get 
me set up and running. It sucks. It's like you gotta really dive, but then you gotta like pull back. But not too much. You don't wanna pull back too much. Is that sticky fly as fucked up as I think it is? Yeah, stay at home, Stegosaurus got soft. He put a fucking 1F0 to re-catch a shell that you might have accidentally knocked off the ledge. Easy. Easy. Easy peasy. The grand prize? Ooh, it's a bingo!
a brand new car! <laughs> so fucking dumb. That's awesome. Not inspired by Morsel. Imagine. Who to blame? Carlicious. I'm first! <laughs> I'm never first. Holy shit. <laughs> I like that you put the green and neon green fruit. Damn, that was such a good hack, dude. That was such a good hack. Mine is one low ground. I, I keep, you know, my, I think my brain is trying to subconsciously just throw that shit out because, um, yeah, I feel like I never remember it. GG, Stego. GG. You can replace it if I bitch enough. Yeah, don't do it. Don't do it. Put an arrow at the fucking throw block right before the pea balloon. That's it. That's all you need. Adding frame rule patch. I mean, you see, here's the thing, right? Is like none of the levels were so egregious that they were like it was necessary. I just think that the game would have a better polish if it had the frame rule patch. And if you wanted the game to be harder, then just make it harder. Like I would, mu like I'm in the boat of if you give me two options, right? Make the game harder, give me frame rule, or take away frame rule, make the game easier. I'm always going to go for the frame rule, but make the game way, way harder. I think that's going to be, I, I think that's going to give it a better level of polish. And I think people will complain less because when it comes to level design, people, people often don't complain about difficulty and they complain about inconsistency. And that's the only thing that frame rule is going to bring compared to the other option. Yeah. Look at that little car, so vanilla. Dude, superb hack. Absolutely magnifique. Magnifique.